Good evening, everybody. Welcome to the studio on 4th. My name is Greg. I'll be your uh, illustrious host this evening. Uh, Lizzie couldn't make it tonight, so I guess tonight is uh, what I like to call Gonzo Open Mic. So let's have some fun with this. Uh, I'm going to start off with a song I wrote less than 48 hours ago. This could be a crapshoot, but we'll see what happens. And this song, uh, the song, the kind of theme is like, well, you know, there's certain kinds of people you meet in life, you know, maybe, maybe you've known somebody who's living a life that's, you know, probably not what they would thought about or envisioned in their life growing up, and, you know, maybe certain things intersect, certain things grow, certain things evolve, certain things deteriorate, some things rise, some things fall, but they're all made out of various kinds of shapes. This song's called Shapes. Go of the 
devil's hand I'd sure like to taste the sweet water too We're spinning circles Dancing in the desert sand And right now it's the shape of our bodies Twisting in the bed Right now it's the shape of the hole In your heart Right now it's the shape of the needle In your arm Right now it's the shape of your ghost Dancing in my head And right now it's the shape of the bottle In my hand And right now it's the shape of our bodies Twisting in the bed Thank y'all. You know, uh, some of you may have had the opportunity to witness me doing characters uh, such as Groofy, or Groovy as he was originally uh, conceived, or perhaps Roger Crapley, you know, every once in a while he comes out to play and Buster Crow. But fear not, tonight they, uh, I've given them the night off. I'm just playing as me, Greg Harmon. Careful what you wish for. Speaking of which, uh, seems like uh, seems like I was this uh, old boy and this old gal. And they enjoyed each other's company quite a bit. And one of their favorite things to do was, uh, uh, I guess they called it back then, uh, cruising. They loved to cruise all over the place. They loved to drive and talk and look at things and make jokes and laugh and carry on and carry on and carry on. Have a big old time. Well, seems like uh, towards the, well, long after the tail end of one of these cruises, or at least in the middle, there was the opportunity to go to uh, uh, this really nice area in Big Smoky Valley in between the Toyabe and the Takima Ranges. Uh, there happens to be some uh, pretty decadent hot springs out there. So they had it all planned out. They had their Buckaroo Pale Ale. They had their Polenta. They had their Hollandaise sauce. They had each other's company, and they had the hot springs. And uh, anyway, this uh, fella comes along, and I believe his name is Ray. He's like, "Hey, you guys, uh, you can go up into that tub up top there. Ain't nobody hanging out there." And thinking, "All right, it's getting better. Getting so much better all the time." And uh, so we went on up there, or at least the old boy and the old gal did. Uh, and uh, they were soaking out there and dipping in the tub. It wasn't super hot, uh, according to legend. Uh, but it was very relaxing, you know. I'd been working out in the field for a number of days, and so it was a good chance to soothe what ailed them in the forms of blisters and pulled muscles and neck weirdness and misaligned vertebrae and what have you. So it was a good soak going on and uh, seems like, uh, as I recall from the legend, some wild burrows come along out there into the high desert, to the hot springs. And where there's smoke, there's fire. Well, it was first one burrow. <laughs> so 
soon grew to a chorus of probably four or five. <laughs> It was cool. Still had plenty of space to share. There was another pond down below they could get their drink from. And then poof, where there's smoke, there's fire. Where there was once four burrows, there's now 20. And apparently by this time, their leader, and uh, I don't recall if his name was Rufus or Jesse. I don't speak burrow fluently like some. Neither did this old boy or this old gal. So anyway, next thing you know, there's about 157 of these fierce, viral, untamed burrows wandering about near this hot tub. <laughs> and I'm like, you calm down, Rufus or Jesse or whatever your name is. Or at least this old boy said that. And they kept carrying along, carrying along, carrying along. This old gal started getting maybe a little bit skittish, but little did we know, or they know, that help was on the way. Because just as Rufus was about to do his rear leg kick right to this old boy's chops, wouldn't you know it, Clint Eastwood, Eli Wallach, and yes, Special guest, Liam Neeson, come cruising up in a limbo. You know, of course, hey, perfect place to film a spaghetti western with an English guy, or Irish or Scottish or whatever the hell Liam Neeson is. So this old boy is like, well, things are looking more in our favor. Doesn't look too good for you and Rufus and Jesse and the rest of your gang now, does it? Eastwood and Wallach and Liam start throwing out the revolvers. Now, once again, little did this old boy know that his the old gal happened to be a Zumba warrior priestess. And in addition to that, happened to bring along her diamond tip stiletto heels. I feel a Mexican standoff coming on. Yeah, we was gunning. Next thing, all you see is donkeys running. And so this song kind of goes out to this. It's a, it's a song called Wild Donkeys. You may have heard a, a variation of it before. Couldn't 
can't scare me away I know I dreamed you A sin and a lie Now you Treat you unkind. Wild donkeys couldn't scare me away. Wild, wild donkeys. Couldn't scare me away I watched you suffer A blister in pain Now you decide Show me the same No sweeping exists All off stage lines Could make me feel bitter Treat you unkind. Wild donkeys couldn't scare me away. Wild, wild donkeys. Couldn't scare me away I know I dreamed you A sin and a lie I have my freedom But I don't have much time Faith has been broken Tears must be cried Let's do some Wild, wild donkeys Couldn't scare me away Wild, wild donkeys We're gonna get bailed out by Clint Eastwood, Eli Wallach, Liam Neeson in a Mexican standoff in a new book warrior priestess someday all right well let's get somebody else up here on the stage uh, let's take a look at the list here
So uh, next up here we have the uh, musical stylings of Herbert. Uh, first time I saw this guy, I was like completely blown away. Uh, it's kind of like the sum is greater than the total of the parts with this guy. You know, the guitar playing's good, the singing's good, but it just kind of turns into its own thing when he puts it together. So without further ado, we'll get Herbert mic'd up and he'll be ready to go. Yeah, it's fine, it probably would. Three, I'll do three, yeah. Just keep it standard. Oh wow, it's on, yay. Hi.
wouldn't it be nice? There's no home for you 
here, girl, go away. There's no home for you here. There's no home for you here, girl, go away. There's no home for you here. I'm not to think in all my content introspective that it's impossible to get along with you. It's hard to look you in the face when we are talking, so it helps to have a mirror in the room. I'm not looking forward to the performance. There's my cue and there's a question on your face. Unfortunately, I have come across an answer, which is go away and do not leave a trace. There's no home for you here, go, go away. There's no home for you here. There's no home for you here, go, go away. There's no home for you here. There's no home for you here, go, go away. There's no home for you here. There's no home for you here, go, go away. There's no home for you here.
pretend you're innocent And if you believe You can't convince yourself I'm sure You can't convince yourself And this town never gave you much back Just rumors and a whisper and a tag And certainly Gonzo, open mic, continued there with Herbert. Everybody give him another nice round of applause. Really like that guy's jam. Uh, so uh, next up, or we're going to skip, uh, we skipped two. Uh, nobody wanted to take number two uh, today, so Herbert was number three. So we have four on the list, uh, Dalton and Adam. And uh, if you've never heard uh, or experienced uh, Dalton and Adam, uh, they do what uh, I love to call like a uh, violin chamber music. Uh, so without further ado, let's get you guys set up here and uh, have some more fun. I'd just like to give a shout out to my family online. They're not in here, here in spirit, but they're online. So my dad especially, he, he asked me to give him a shout out, so. Hi, Dad. What's up, Adam's dad? All right, so. Uh, Songs by the Postal Service. strangest dream where everything was exactly how it seemed there was never any mystery of who shot John F. Kennedy it was just a man with something to prove slightly bored and severely confused he steadied his rifle with his target in the center and became famous on that day in November Again last night I had that strange dream 
Where everything was exactly how it seemed Concerns about the world getting warmer People thought that they were just being rewarded For treating others as they'd like to be treated Obeying stop signs and curing diseases For mailing letters with the address on the center And we can swim any day in November Don't wake me, I plan on sleeping 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 So, we, don't, we didn't plan out what songs we were going to play, so what do you want to play? The song's called Whoa. All the words in my mouth that did seem deemed unworthy of letting out Banded together to form a makeshift militia And burrow bluntly through my tongue and my teeth And I stood proud in the gallery With my open socket of a mouth for them to see They all just laughed and said That boy he, that boy's got woe This girl who I've met Whose pride makes her hard to forget She took pity on me horizontally But most likely because of my band And that's all I can get when I'm lonely And these visions of death seem to own me In the quiet of the classrooms All across the stacked United States of woe Whoa We live with woe I can't get laid in this town without these pointy fucking shoes. My feet are so black and blue, and so are you. Please take me out of my body up through the palm trees to smell California in sweet hypocrisy. Floating my senses around my body I wake my nose to smell that ocean burn And now I'm 
forging ahead Past all the plutocrats who sold me out Go sob in your bed If life is twice as pretty once you're dead Then send me a card I'm still the optimist Though it is hard When all you want to be Is in a dream A dream. She says, La da da, la da da, la da 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 da, la da da, la da da, la da 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 da, la da da, la da da, la da 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 da, la da da, la da da, la da da. Da, da. What now? One more. Which one? Yeah, one more. So. Hmm? Yeah. Hmm? <laughs> you down? Sure. Here you go. I love this song so much. Me too, man. I'm broke, but I'm happy. I'm poor, but I'm kind. I'm short, but I'm healthy. I'm high, but I'm grounded. I'm sane, but overwhelmed. I'm lost, and I'm hopeful. Baby, yeah, what it all comes down to is that everything's gonna be fine, fine, fine. I got one hand in my pocket, and the other one's giving a high five. I feel drunk, but I'm sober. I'm young and underpaid. I'm tired, but working, yeah. I care, but I'm restless. I'm here, but really gone. I'm wrong and I'm sorry, baby. Yeah, what it all boils down to is that everything's gonna be quite all right. I got one hand in my pocket. And the other one's flicking a cigarette. And what it all boils down to, my friends, yeah. Is that I haven't really got it figured out just yet, yeah, yeah, yeah. I've got one hand in my pocket and the other one's giving a peace sign. I'm free, but I'm focused. I'm green, but I'm wise. I'm hard, but I'm friendly, baby. I'm sad, but I'm laughing. I'm brave, but chicken shit. I'm sick, but I'm pretty, baby. Yeah, what it all comes down to. Is that no one's really got it figured out just yet, yeah, yeah, yeah. Cause I got one hand in my pocket.
bucket and the other one's playing a piano and what it all comes down to my friends yeah is that everything is just fine 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 cause I got one hand in my pocket and the other one sailing a taxi cab Thanks, guys. Thanks, man. And give it up one more time for the wonderful musical stylings of Andy and Dalton. Uh, yeah, a real measure of like you know musical artistry is like keep coming around and seeing uh, the same people playing. Yeah, but are they getting better? And yeah, these guys get better every time I see them. So. Uh, Maybe stick around for an encore presentation in a little while, get them back up on stage. Uh, I have an announcement. Uh, uh, the pizza has arrived, so uh, eat up. Uh, I'd like to thank uh, Core Studio and Forth for hosting this. Uh, Doug, you do a wonderful job with the streaming and the, and the, uh, the sound in general. Uh, and George is a really friendly guy behind the bar there, so. Give them a pat on the back, too. Uh, next up, uh, first let me give a shout out to all the people out there in Webland. Uh, you know who you are, because you're watching. Uh, and we appreciate that, too. Uh, it's a really unique uh, kind of thing uh, they got going on here. And uh, yeah, thanks for tuning in. So next up, uh, we have a young lady met this evening. She claims this is her first time here. Uh, she brought a little ukulele. I believe she's self-taught. Uh, look forward to hearing what she has to, to do up here on stage. So please give a warm welcome to Vanessa.
Well, let's hear it again for Vanessa. That was wonderful. <clears throat> it really uh, took me back to uh, a time when I lived over there on the Big Island and it was just about anywhere and you get that good Jawaiian and ukulele music. It's something to experience. So thank you very much for sharing that. Uh, next up, we have uh, Scott Monroe. He's going to start setting up here. I think Doug's going to help him a little bit. And uh, sounds like this is going to be quite an experience. Up here, I uh, want to give a couple shout outs to a few people in particular. Uh, welcome back to the U.S., Mr. Manny Moss. Uh, Manny's been off having an archaeological adventure in Western Turkey. That's my best guess anyway. He's an archaeologist and he was in Western Turkey for a bit, so I, I try to put two and two together sometimes. Just in and out. <clears throat> yeah, it seems like there's all kinds of cool uh, upcoming events here at Studio in Force, so be sure to check the website. Uh, should be some rock and roll music coming through here every now and again. Uh, occasional burlesque or whatever that is stuff is called show. Uh, it's a good venue, of course, and we like to support, you know, good art spaces like this, so keep coming back. So uh, I was driving back from Eureka a few days ago, and, you know, if you ever spent any time out there on Highway 50, the loneliest road in America, you know, the foot can get heavy on the gas pedal from time to time. And uh, uh, it gives the local constabulary in the form of Nevada State Police an opportunity to, well, do something, even if it's wrong. So... See the flashing red lights behind me. And I'm like, okay, here we go. Pull over. Officer comes out and says, looks at my license. Mr. Harmon, you realize you were going 92 in a, in a 70. It's like, well, officer, to be honest with you, you know, I was just kind of distracted by the you know, beauty of uh, being surrounded by mountains and 360 degree view and cruising through the playas and just experiencing the wonderful sage of the high desert. And he's like, starts swatting around. He's writing the ticket and he's swatting around some kind of fly, like flying in circles over there by his head. And he's starting to affect him writing his ticket and it's like, you're having some trouble over there, officer. And he's like, yeah, you know, this, this dang horse fly keeps buzzing around me up in my face and bothering me and so forth. And I was like, well, you know, it, I, hate, I hate to correct you, sir, but that's actually a circle fly. And he was looking at me like, what? I was like, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah you get those down over here in the big smoky valley area. They're pretty localized here. He's like, I ain't never heard of no circle fly. I was like, oh yeah, you know, they, you know, they're their own gene, genus and species and specific to this area here. And uh, uh, what they do is they fly around in circles and all day long in search of a horse's ass. He steps back for a minute. He stops writing that ticket. He's like, Mr. Harmon? Are you calling me a horse's ass? Said, oh, with all due respect, sir, no, sir. But circle flies, they do not lie.
This should be it. Yeah, I probably wouldn't want to need to get too loud on this guy. Yeah, yeah. this will be the only thing we probably won't have to do. And then this. I don't know. Don't look for we'll have fun with that. Okay. We're on. All right, so without further ado, please give a warm welcome to Scott Monroe. Hello, my name is Scott Monroe. I'm going to play some percussion for you. I do acid jazz. I hope everybody uh, has had a good night tonight. Uh, a lot of uh, mellow kind of stuff and a lot of stories being told today. There's no stories from here. I just play. So let's see what we got going here. We get a drum going. And we'll see if we get Perfect.
that loop originally re was recorded about at about uh, two years ago uh, at the uh, underground when I played over there, and uh, it's been recycled. And I keep it, and it originally originated over there, so it has a local origin. So now we're going to do another one that was from the same show.
Now we're talking. That was some kind of good there, Scott. Thank you. Something good, bro. Some kind of good. So, uh, I know somebody that looks exactly like me promised you. You didn't get it in writing, though. Keep that in mind. That uh, such characters as Groofy or Roger Crapley or Buster Crestus would not be making an appearance tonight, but there's been, a, there's been a bit of a mutiny. So we'd like to welcome Groovy up to the stage. He's kind of a close friend of mine. Hey, Andy and Dalton, uh, y'all got any more songs? Can you, can, you think of, can you think of a song or two to pick after this uh, event? And, and does anybody have a, a spare pick for a minute? Uh, I think mine ended up in the pizza. Well, it is God's own night, man. Come on, I'm flexible. Hold on, I got one over here. I found it, man. I found it, man. Hey man. How y'all doing, man? What's been going on out there since um, that last time we gathered and had a lot of fun like this? This song is called Tuning Into Open G. It's real catchy. I think the kids are gonna dig it this summer. It's the feel good. Hit of the silly summer Makes the kids go out of control Sometimes I get possessed by Todd Snyder too, man I'd like to give a shout out to an uh, old friend of mine I uh, uh, caught up with here recently a little bit, shared her stories. And uh, this one goes out to the witchy woman from The Ville.
And now you're laying me down to sleep My only prayer is not too deep That I trust you watch for life Towers find your train The streets today, the lives you say Death you steal from sickly moans Try one more. See if you stay in tune at all here. Yeah. Yeah. 
If you're going to play an open G, make sure that the G string is turned tuned exactly to G. Just a hint. Man. Yeah, man, you get me, man. Groovy, don't make me put you back in your room. Come on, man, that guy gets me, man, you know it. Close enough for the rock and the roll. Ready for more Andy and Dalton besides this guy? Clap louder, you people out there in Webland, man. We can barely hear you. Uh, is, is, yeah, you, you guys too. I mean. Yes, this is a great, wonderful weekly celebration of organic, live, homegrown Reno. Although I'm originally from the East Coast, and I think you guys are from Kansas or somewhere, but whatever, it's cool. Uh, give everybody ourselves. Doug, George, Studio and Forth, a huge hand. 
And let's get uh, Andy and Dalton back up on stage here for their encore manifestations. Oh yeah, you guys watching that on the web there? They got all kinds of good like local craft beers on tap here. It's uh, kind of rolled over into something something good. So come on down here. They got flavors from uh, all the good breweries here in town. And uh, I'm gonna go sip on one myself because I'm parched. Yeah, sure, next week we got it. We got it, man. Oh, it's the wrong one. That would make sense. Crippled hand, I can't even twist it. So, for all three of you out there, this. See? People at home, online peeps. Songs called You Don't Use Jelly, it's by the Flaming Lips. Toast, but she don't use butter and she don't use cheese, she don't use jelly or any of these. She uses Vaseline, Vaseline, Vaseline. Tissues or his sleeve. He don't use napkins or any of these. He uses magazines. 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 Mag She's always changing the color of her hair. She don't use nothing that you buy in the store. 
She likes her hair to be really orange. She uses tangerines. 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 Thanks. <laughs> this next song is a change of pace. It's called A Walk Through Hell. They chose you as a model for their empty little dreams With your new head and your legs spread like a filthy magazine And they'd hunt you and they'd gut you and you'd give in And if I was brave, I'd climb up to you on the mountain Let you to drink from their fountain, spouting Mission. Steer me away from my mission to your eyes And I'd stand there like a soldier with my foot upon his chest With my grin spread and my arms out and my bloodstained Sunday's best And I'd hold you and remind you who you are under their shell I'd walk through hell for you Let it burn right through my shoes These souls are useless without you Through hell for you Let the torturing ensue My soul is useless without you If they send a whirlwind, I'd hug it like a harmless little tree. Or an earthquake, I'd calm it, I'd bring you back to me. And I'd hold you in my weak arms like a firstborn. I'd walk through hell for you. Let it burn right through my shoes These souls are useless without you Through hell for you Let the torturing ensue My soul is useless without you an adventure to do but rest these feet at home with you sorry about that thanks guys this is the gay song it's not really called the gay song but that's what I call it it's called if I were gay So 
sorry. Here we are, dear old friend. You and I, drunk again. Laughs have been had and tears have been shed. Yeah, maybe the whiskey's gone to my head. But if I were gay, I would give you my heart. And if I were gay, you'd be my work of art. And if I were gay, we would swim in romance. But I'm not gay, so get your hand out of my pants. It's not that I don't care, I do. I just don't see myself in you. Another time, another scene. I'd be right behind you, if you know what I mean. And if I were gay, I would give you my soul. And if I were gay, I would give you my whole being. And if I were gay, we would tear down these walls. But I'm not gay, so won't you stop cupping my hand? We've never hugged, we've never kissed I've never been intimate with your fist But your love's open, brand new doors Get over here and drop your drawers Should we do one more? A, sh a short one? Huh? All right, lights still on. So this is by the same artist. It's another funny one. We haven't done this in a long time, but I hope it works out. Hand in hand, we walk the city beneath the darkened skies. Stealing kisses in the shadows away from prying Hiding out from those we know Secrets whispered, voices low Pulses racing, hearts aflame A love that dare not speak its name Well, we just can't let people see That you're not hot enough for me Don't tell our family or our friends Just one word Shit ends my boo Cause I'm prettier than you I'll take you on a special date Enjoy your company If someone we know happens by Just hide behind that tree to a late night picture show Or planetarium will go A midnight picnic at the park Anywhere that's really dark And we just can't let people see That you're not hot enough for me Just close your eyes and sing along At least I wrote you a is much prettier than you I wish I weren't a shallow man I wish that I cared not I wish I weren't so superficial I wish you were more I should not be ashamed, you see I love your personality And what we have is good and true Cause you got me and lucky you 
Yeah, we just can't let people see that you're not hard enough for me. But I'll enjoy this right or wrong till someone better comes along. It's true. If she's prettier than you. Thanks, guys. It's fun. You like that? Well, I suppose that wraps up things here tonight. I'd like to thank everybody for coming out. And uh, it was fun guest hosting here, kind of in a surprise way. Uh, but yeah, I love this place, and I'm all about it. So yeah, hosting, no big deal. Uh, and uh, as uh, my cousin Leisha's uh, husband Tony says, I love good live music. I don't care who it is. Good night, everybody. <laughs>